Hello guys, this is Letatools. Today I'm going to do a review on KS Play Punch catalog and uh, uh, prone punches and the pricking irons that I got uh, for a while. Uh, I've been busy for uh, a few few weeks, so I haven't done any review. Sorry guys, so this is the today's review. Okay, so it's KS Play Punch. Uh, it's a fairly new company started uh, making uh, leather tools uh, since 2016. Uh, but they, they've been making uh, punches for the uh, other industry uh, and have been exporting their tools to Japan and other overseas. Um, they are, um, it's, it is company and it's actually a factory in Korea. They manufacture a, um, really nice uh, tools for the machines and etc. So they've been making, uh, they've been around uh, for a long time but they are now doing the leather craft tools also. So now uh, I'll show you the contact information if you guys uh, want to contact them. Uh, this is uh, their emails and their address that you can look around. Uh, and their telephone number and fax number. Um, this is the email you should guys contact first uh, if you want to buy these tools, okay? It's KS, KS, bsales at ksblades.co.kr, okay? Okay, now first page is uh, about the uh, multi punch. Uh, by the way, this PDA uh, came from the uh, the case plays. Uh, you, if you sent them email, you could also get the same PDF. You guys, uh, if you want uh, to look it up for yourself. Anyways, uh, uh, the price on these uh, uh, you can you could there are two handle types: the one with the hole and without the hole. Uh, the difference is that. Um, I asked the guy why there's a hole and without hole. Uh, uh, depending on the size, uh, the punches have the side holes and uh, without the side holes. So if you use this uh, on this handle, uh, it, it looks fine. But if you use this uh, type of uh, punch on this uh, handle, it makes two holes. So that would be weird. So th that may so he made uh, one with the hole and without the hole, so that you guys choose um, what you what you want. So. I think so. They, they, you know, thought about the designs, you know, after they assembled. So you can interchangeable. It's the the punches are interchangeable to the handle. Um, this is not a screw type. Uh, you can actually there's a um, small nut screw. You can see and you can um, the the Allen wrench, the hex wrench comes together. So you can join the um, the punch itself in the handle. Uh, the normally um, oh, just uh, ordinary stuff they they just screw down the punches to the handle but this one's not uh, you need to have this nut screw I believe it's, this is a standard size and uh, you could also choose separately what you need for what you you, you could choose what size you need but um, here they also offer you as a set okay uh, this is a multi bar one three nine four plus five kinds of punch and there's the size and this is punch M set uh, and pro sets okay I think uh, it varies on uh, the punch sizes so you guys check it out here and then there's a professional punch okay uh, this is a professional punch this is not repressible blade this is just the punch itself you guys normally see uh, this is made of uh, all the cast play punches are made of a uh, bearing steel, which is very high. It has a very high wear resistance. Uh, it's uh, specifically it's SAU J2, I think. It's a bearing steel, uh, professionally heat treated at the factory by themselves. Okay, now so see if you see the price uh, on these, uh, it's almost it ranges from twenty dollars to thirty five dollars. Uh, this is diameter they have uh, the old type means it is punches so small hole that is all it acts almost like a hole so after you punch them uh, it makes 0 0.2 millimeter holes okay these are all size in millimeters okay so you have to convert them in inches if you want in uh, in um, uh, in inches or other uh, countries okay these are all the millimeters okay now I got 2.0 millimeter punches, which is 21 US dollar. Okay, as far as it, it gets bigger, it, it's got more expensive. It's uh, 10 
mm side punch is to 35 US dollar and they what they do uh, I'm sure if you ask uh, you could go higher than 10 millimeter uh, they can you know they machine these punches so I think you can customize the punch yourself I think but I'm not sure you have to ask them um, they also sell them in a sets uh, like the basic sets they have one two and three four and five millimeter sets and they have also offer you a special sets which means 0 0.2 to 1, 1.5, 2, 2.5, 3, all the way to 5 millimeter. And this is Pro Punch and Luxurious, luxurious Sets is that the special sets and Luxurious Sets have a, uh, they have 6.0 and 7.0 millimeter. Uh, you have include two punches more and it has Luxury Gift Case which is this is made of wood. Uh, it's, uh, I think it's an old CNC machined and nicely you know they in a they have inserted that you can put the punches in and you can easily take out because there is a, a deeper uh, cutout at the uh, at the end of the handle so you can press it and the the punches will rise up so there will be no problem you can easily take it out there okay now uh, this is the round end I will show you in a minute uh, I got the round end for you know to, to the cross stitch and the um, if you t turn out uh, if you do the turn out technique which will you sew out you you sew the outside uh, of the the um, project what you're doing and you you turn the inside out you know so that you can, you can hide the stitches but if you uh, use the pricking irons for that uh, for that technique, um, they will show you uh, the holes a lot, and uh, you know it will, you know, it just doesn't look really nice. So um, I use uh, round end for that. So and the uh, price on these uh, two point forty five. Uh, the price on this um, it depends on the, how many teeth you have. So if you have a if you Want to have just on one tooth? Uh, it only costs thirty dollars. But if you want to have um, ten teeth, this uh, it costs one hundred sixty dollar. This is a uh, U.S. dollar. Okay. So and distance are these. This is the distance. Okay. Uh, you guys might uh, are more familiar with the uh, SBI units, uh, stitches per inch. But uh, they come in like this. Uh, this is like Blanchard standard, I think. So you guys have to check it out for yourself uh, if what you, what you guys need are what what you want, okay? And this is newly made. Uh, this is fairly new. It's a pricking iron. Uh, these are uh, pricking irons showing like this, and uh, price on these are uh, same. Uh, ten ten tooths are one hundred sixty US dollar and one. One teeth, one tooth is uh, thirty US dollars. Distance also same with the uh, round end breaking iron. Okay. Now this is very interesting. I I was looking for this kind of punches for a long time. Now it came. Uh, uh, this is holes punch. Okay, and it makes uh, not a breaking iron holes, but it actually the hole. Okay, uh, the punch sizes varies from one point zero and one point two, and one point five. For holes punch one, there's hole punch two, which has a different size of holes. Okay, and distance you can choose this distance between the holes. Okay, so hole diameter is this, and distance is the um, length between the hole center. Okay, and this is the price they offer: um, two teeth, um, sixty US dollar. Eight eight teeth is uh, one hundred sixty US dollar, and you can also. Uh, have a replacement punch. Uh, by the way, these all these uh, pricking irons also offer you the um, extra blades in case you drop them. In case they are bent or broken, you can easily replace the teeth by yourself. Okay, I'll show you it in a minute. Anyway, so okay, so the, you can have you can buy the repli replaceable punch for nine dollars per one one punch. Okay, and you can replace the repeal punch, and you have to use 1.5 millimeter hex wrench. If you live in a, a non-metric system, uh, I think you will have to ask for the 1.5 millimeter hex wrench because um, at the size really, it's very similar, but uh, it it doesn't. If it's not a 
perfect fit, uh, you might ruin the, the nut screw. So please, you know, ask for a uh, hex wrench if you guys want to buy, buy this. This is really nice because um, this is just a punch, but the, the fact is that these are all machined nicely. So it's the holes are lined in perfect manner. So if you are a watch band maker, if you you, you do you have you are a belt maker or anything, um, you need to have a consistent even spacing holes, right? So um, it but it is hard to achievable, um, but and it's expensive if you want to have a very exact aligned holes. Um, I I tried to contact the local the um, die maker and punch maker to you know um, weld the uh, punches in a line so that I can have an exact same line, the punchy line. But uh, after punching the holes, I could see some of the imperfection in the alignment hole holes. But this is really perfect holes. Um, you c these are all machined cut so that it aligns perfectly so I definitely recommend if you are a watch band maker you know try try this guy's punches okay and if you want to go bigger sizes 2.0 or 2.5 5 millimeter holes size and distance like this uh, price is a little bit higher okay uh, 8, eight twos is um, 180 6 twos 160 and repeal punch is a little bit higher too it's uh, almost $10 but uh, it's worth, I think it's worth buying, okay? And uh, wholesale terms is that at the accepting the payment is bank transfer and 50 up front and 50 after manufacturing and before delivery. And lead time is minimum two weeks, okay? So minimum two weeks, you have to wait. And including shipping, I think minimum three, three weeks is um, leading time, okay? Uh, shipping method will be EMS. Uh, and I'll show you. Uh, this is uh, just a two sheet. Uh, this is the shipping price they offer. Um, this is uh, if you. Uh, I'll just uh, look through the um, one of the main countries. Uh, okay, uh, Japan. If you. Uh, by the way, these are not almost. If you don't buy a huge lot, uh, this. I think the first line will be you know end of the uh, the final uh, weight. Okay, so. 2.5 kilometer. Uh, this is US dollar, Japan 27 US dollar, and Hong Kong and Singapore 28, China 28, Australia 54, USA 65, and Russia is 55 US dollar it costs. So this is the shipping price you have to pay uh, uh, with, with the price of the tool. Okay, so if you buy 10 T's, it's uh, 160 plus. EMS shipping to Japan, so 27 and okay, so that and they have other countries as well at the bottom, so you can you can group one. If you are in group three, you can check the group three. Okay. All right, that that was it. Okay, I went through this catalog and the video is already 15 minutes long, <laughs> so I'll show you guys quickly. Okay, now this is a uh, case play punch. Uh, this is Pro Punch I just received yesterday, and this is really nice uh, packaging. It came with it has a bubble wrap inside, and it's really sturdy uh, paper bag. I'm sure they will put this in another bag, so it will be totally safe. I really like the packaging too. Okay, it's a KS Play Punch. Okay, now here's the punch. Let me show you. It's uh, it's this whole uh, punch is made of a SAUJ2 bearing steel. Okay, uh, it's really nice. Uh, it's been machined nicely. It says just uh, two on it, and it says oops, just use bear one. It says cast play punches. Okay, come on, focus. And um, they're sharp, sharp, and um, 
they really um, holds an edge. Okay, I'll show you the demo later. Okay, um, I will do more detail of this punch because it's really different from what they guys, what they, from the cheap punches we are used to. Okay, and uh, I will do more depth on these two. Uh, this is uh, pricking irons, round dent pricking irons, and I will do review on them also. Uh, it's uh, I got 5.01 like this. It's uh, pretty shiny, isn't it? I I use I use them and the uh, the black oxide finish came off, but uh, it doesn't really matter. Just um, it, it has a as long as it's um, polished. You know, it's it's good to you know use use them on the leather. Here you have um, the teeth. How many teeth you got? And the the spacing. This is custom made for me. Okay, I asked them for 5.0 millimeter spacing. Okay, can I press punch? And my my name is engraved. Okay, this is a lightly etched laser engraving. So I I don't feel anything. It's just very smooth. It's um little tools, but these are really um kind of deep deep engraving. Uh, I, I believe it's done by laser, but it's done heavily, so it's really I, you could really feel the um, the numbers and the letterings. Okay, so these are hard to be removed, so don't worry. Okay, but uh, I'm not sure on the the name itself on the pricking irons, uh, but they're quite nice though. It's a uh, little tools and but two um, two teeth little tools also. And like this, and I also got this replacement teeth for their pricking irons because I want to try them. I wanted to use them as an old blade. Okay, these are also made of a bearing steel. By the way, this whole uh, body and the teeth and everything, except for the um, this uh, nut screw are not except for the nut screw everything is made of a bearing steel okay it's pretty hefty not a too heavy tool but it's it has a good weight on it okay so the whole body is made of a good steel that can be used for cutting tools and uh, punches and etc okay so these are the pricking iron teeth that I received to use as the O. Uh, I have this old you know that it can be used it's interchangeable old blade so I will replace the old blade with the pricking iron teeth and use it as a old, old, old the old blade so I'm sure uh, it will work nicely okay I'll, sh I'll, I'll show you how, how it goes a little later too okay so this video has been too long so I will break it down into several videos uh, reviewing each, each of the tools and uh, I hope you guys will like it and if you if you like the video please press thumbs up and subscribe my channel and i will see you guys in the next video bye bye